Oh god, 200 TV down. I think I've played these guys before. I think he had a... I think he had a pawn that was missed next game, didn't he? Yeah, beat them when his pawn was missed next game. But now he's just going to all bash us. <laughs> 12 guys. Pom, string four guard, yeah, remember him, remember him. Both, oh, we're only moving six, one of the strippers, armor eight, witch elf. Still, he hasn't got that much dodge, at least. Oh, he's got a bit more now, though. One, two, three blodgers. Oh, I'll probably lose this game, I reckon. At least, I, at least I've got a way to get the ball down with a wizard. And a babe to numb the pain of all the all the cas he's gonna make with his pommel. Yeah, fatting, yeah, exactly fatting. I think I've cracked it. I think I've cracked how to explain it with graphs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it seems a few. Elves. Elves gonna elf. I don't want to receive the ball in the rain. As much as I'd love to receive. Strength four guard. All the strength four. <laughs> the rain and morning. <laughs> Get some more subs, yeah. Yeah, exactly, Wolfback. Exactly, that's it. I don't hate him. It's just that I hate his attitude and that, you know? But again, CJ Blackburn, it's the... It's full TV+. Plus. To be fair, my main argument is with full TV+. Plus, you know? At, at the moment, um, it's more the principle, really, as it isn't working properly, which is good. And uh, it's more the principle of the thing, more than anything, especially with full TV+. Plus. Yeah, exactly, Wolfbark, or twists it. Twists it, you know, that, that's, that's what I don't like as well. Like twisting, twisting things and stuff. It is. It is the same thing. Yeah. <laughs> Last time you he had a miss. His plumber was missing next game, and this time it isn't. So he's got he's got twelve players. I'd rather he only had eleven, and I didn't have a wizard to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, exactly, Wolfbag. Exactly. I don't think he's prepared to back down at all. But I think what I'd like to do is make a good video saying all about how I think, <laughs> rather than it's a fact, why I think TV Plus is horrible. Um, full TV Plus, particularly. And why I hope normal TV, like, you know, TV plus matching doesn't happen, blah, blah, blah. Write loads of, sh you know, say loads of shit, show these graphs and everything. And 
just show Dode why he's wrong. And then at least, at least people could look at it and think, all right, yeah, I see that. I see the point. I see what Dode's trying to achieve, and I also see why he's wrong. And if uh, that would be good enough for me, to be honest. Well, some of them like TV Plus, though. <laughs> Orange and his say they do. Canal will endorse TV Plus, I think. His excuse was he, he wins too much, so it should happen. But, I mean, if it was NAF style, then obviously you just match by win rating, don't you? But you still wouldn't go full TV plus of them getting inducements. You would just have you would still have fair teams, wouldn't you? You would just try to get the good players playing each other and the bad players playing each other. If the teams were always using the same resources. Rune doesn't even affect him, does he? Because he's at five. <laughs> Bastard. <laughs> yeah, well, fun. Because Voodoo Mike and Dode have driven everybody away from it. I mean, even then, the, and even then, there would only be a small percentage of people who would go there anyway. So I. Play a whole game, whole half against Orcs without doing anything. Two armor seven with mighty blow <laughs> and piling on. <laughs> and turn one against fucking Dargal. <laughs> and someone fucking killed. <laughs> oh fuck off. <laughs> Just can't even apple it because of his fucking pommer. Exactly, Wolfbar. Exactly. It really does. It really does for bash teams. Like, elves can, can fucking still win through it, can't they? Which is why Dark Elves were the team of choice of all good players when Blood Bowl 2 started. Yeah, Wrath of Nuke Man, yeah, that happened. That happened with my chops. I had a one game with chops and fucking got got something like two warriors killed, two chalf blockers killed and bull sent or niggled or something stupid. I'm getting his skill ups because he just doesn't give a fuck. Three plus pick up. And he could have had a two plus. Just taking the piss. Yeah, exactly, Sword of the Morning. VIP Sword of the Morning, it's true, isn't it? It's like... It is indeed my turn. Oh, look at this guy. 
He loves his farming. <laughs> it's really annoying. <laughs> it's really annoying. Zero respect. I can't even play him. The progression of Blood Bowl is, re is, you know, it makes ma any matchmaking really hard. Whether you agree with TV Plus or not, or have your own funky idea. That's the killer, is the, uh, is the progression aspect. Um, I think it's more detrimental in in progression. I don't like it, but in uh, in like NAF style, it's uh, it's a lot more feasible. Oh, I got a stun. <laughs> hey. Two stuns and a Kaz. <laughs> Turn one against. <laughs> he, he did have a Palmer, to be fair, but fucking hell. Against an agility team. Feels fucking hard to win, man. I played a tiny bit of Blood Bowl 1. Um, mostly Fumble. And then... Uh, which AV? No, it didn't. I was hit by a claw. <laughs> Just quietly. <laughs> yeah, that's why I was like, I hope you like your armor over, over block because block would have been alright, wouldn't he? But, uh, yeah, seven plus one for the night block. Cool. Yeah, that is the key thing why you never take AV. Because even while AV is going to Witch Elf, when you play fucking Chaos and they call you anyway, you're like, what the fuck is this shit? I would like to see AV applied after Claw. So you would have, you know, it'd be harder to... You could make... Um, <laughs> so, you know, you could, make, you could then even make, um, like, Tree Men, Armor 9 plus 1. And stuff like that to make them harder to play, if that's what you wanted. No. Yeah, I left him a lot of moves. Room to. A lot of room for maneuverment there. But still, he's got to think about the wizard, hasn't he? Might be a chance with the wizard. Like, plus AV is a huge difference for, like, a witch elf or a war dance or whatever, going from 7 to 8. But, um... The thing is, it's just you can get clawed anyway. I 
And the fact that it only works when you get hit is a bit crap, isn't it? Love a double one here. Oh, it would be game over, wouldn't it? Maybe not that extreme. But it would have been really fucking good. I not make bubbles roll in the rain, absolutely. Fair enough, Tony. Yeah, they were really bad then. In the, those dark, the dark days. Oh yeah! Oh god! I love that bow. Oh yeah! Let's get the strength, the strength of the guard guys there. You have to use three guys to hit him. about that can yeah yeah they used to be terrible yeah before they got agility access I don't think so, what far. Revenge of the Niggle Goat, yeah, absolutely. Well, not maybe used to be worse, they definitely used to be worse. I guess it's arguable whether they were really bad or not, but I think they are. Yeah, I guess they weren't really bad, but they were just unexciting, weren't they? Mm. He got the assists on his greeted that reroll because <laughs> greed rerolled the hit with his pommer because why wouldn't you when all you're doing is making passes in the lane all the time? This guy's gonna get hit by claw pom if he's not look if he's if he doesn't score <laughs> or foul the pommer to death. Mm. 
Now, very clever cancelling out the assist of the guard over there. I like that play. Reverse fen frenzy trap. Good for you. It's unfortunate that the Dodgers. The like four blodges that he's got are fucking good enough, aren't they, to just run rings around us all the time? Alright, time for some dedication to the ball here. That's what I get when I, when I get to blitz the opposing killer. I get to lose a reroll and achieve nothing. Yeah. <sighs> he hits back. Kills a guard. <laughs> Holy shit. Two deaths I pulled in one day. Outrageous. <sighs> this is why TV Plus is wrong, isn't it? You know? I get the palm hit. The claw palm hit. He gets the mighty blow hit, well, palm hit. He gets a kill, I get nothing, you know? It's like there's just too much luck involved to try and precisely manage how far somebody is down TV without inducements to cover, to cover it. It just makes the game as decided by luck. But Doug can't see it, and I guess we'll never see it. But I've got, I've got, I've got the idea of how to, how to, like, display it to people. But um, I don't think Dodd will ever listen. He'll just explain why he's right.
So half a chance for the wizard to be able to force it through. Hopefully changing weather. I guess the cars aren't so bad. We've both got 11. I've got more rowdy stuff. But we need two rerolls is disappointing. Wish I hadn't wasted that reroll not killing his killer. Yeah, he hasn't failed. Yeah, I mean, look, to be fair, like, he is, he's in a pickle, isn't he, when he's based by strength four and claw and everything, it's, and he's got the dodges, so. He managed to pull me around the pitch fairly well. But I mean, I gave up affecting the, the putting pressure on still, and he still scored, so that was okay, wasn't it, actually? Making that claw pump hit. <laughs> I bet as well. <laughs> I bet that as well. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think I'll ever be able to convert Dold. But if I can just make a really good informational video, exactly you count with logic and stats, and then do like a good, a really good video, and then people can be like, you know, fair enough. I, I know I can't change his mind. I just know it's not possible. And it just gets me down. <laughs> Ganfowl, now I know I am. as much as I can do against the Blitz, probably. It's all gonna fuck us, isn't it? Yeah, exactly, just to, uh, yeah, you know, just try. It's <laughs> the keeper of secret. Well, one of the runners is for leader. Oh, I didn't. I didn't confirm. One of the leaders is for reroll. The other one's fucking movement eight and agility five. So he's he's actually pretty good. Movement eight, agility five. One. Oh, he's a bit kick. He kicks short, doesn't he? For some reason. I guess so. His edge five can just recover it. All right. Yeah, that's why. That's why he exposed him.
<laughs> let's not be nasty BB snack. <laughs> um, Sid by it plus the B, fucking hell. Um, yeah, I mean, that's the idea, isn't it? Because it favours a defending player because, you know, just getting to receive favours the receiving player, doesn't it? The record was, in, um, it wasn't that good. It was like 112 or state or something. But it was good enough. I remember playing him, he just fucking dives in for the strip every turn. Was that him? I don't know, somebody did. Maybe I don't remember. No, I think it was a wood elf that dived in for the strip every turn. Yeah, that's a good point, Gwenarkin, that's a good point. That was him. Yeah. yeah, that's a fair point. That was him, that witch eye, fair enough, man. Yeah, almost fire. <laughs> oh, man. I can't believe that I was going to get a claw pom, his pommer, and instead I just get half the team knocked down. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. Like, at least it was over one side, so there was still, like, you know, something there. If it had been a couple in the middle or whatever, and he just blows the holes, at least there's not a gaping hole for him to run through. Oh, fucking hell, that was rough. Yeah, there was a kid that like that, but just recently there was a, either a war dancer or a witch elf that was just like... Yeah, it was the war dancer one, it was the witch elf, because it was, uh, it was red dice, got two pushes. Another red dice, two pushes, or push pal. And then uh, and then in the second time, it was pushes into a, a triple red dice and got triple pushes. Yeah, yeah, but okay. Yeah. Yeah, it was, yeah, it was. Stop it! Stop! Stop being out bashed by elves! I don't know what team I can make. I just want to not get out bashed by elves. Oh man. Pro tips orcs just got all their fucking players killed. Right. So I need to blitz him to get through anyway, I heard. GFI, I don't GFI with it. And I have to GFI though, right?
tout de même. Oh, beau fardeau. the thing. Yeah, it happens less often, but it still happens and you just lose because you have no out here yeah, exactly. 100 subs just a day after the wheel. Yeah, I fixed to you. Three <laughs> Yeah, I think he'll push for it just because he has kind of overcommitted, hasn't he? Yeah, I think I will give the plus strength. Sure hand. Have you got sound jelly deals? Do you actually have sound? Um... I thought it went as well as it could do for everybody. Mm -hmm. But I think a lot of it was fucking just wish listing, you know? It was kind of pointless. Like, even the things that I wanted, it's just kind of pointless wish listing, isn't it? You know? It's not going to make. Having a better dice recap isn't going to make cyanide money, is it? So, why should it happen? But I think what would, would be good would be to have, like, a champs ladder round table. You know? Because we can affect champs ladder. And everyone who... Well, not everyone. <laughs> everyone who watches Andy Dave or and myself and Shawnee and Crucifer watches Champs Ladder. So, you know, maybe we should get a, ch a, 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 a round table of those people in and talk about Champs Ladder, something we could actually, you know, hopefully have some impact on. You know? Yeah, the multi spinning is the biggest thing. The biggest thing to to combat the low player base and everything. <laughs> Some people do so. I, mean, I don't insult anybody, you know. I was just trying to think of people who play champs ladder. Obviously, Sage barely plays champs ladder. Canot doesn't play champs ladder. Yeah, there's people. I often see people watching Crucifer, and I mean he, he does well on champs ladder, doesn't he? Uh, which as well, which is a thing. Yeah, here he goes again. <laughs> He's got wrestle! <gasps> oh my god. He even this tripped me anyway though, wasn't he? I should have been pushed. No, no, wrestle gets him down. No, wrestle's probably better actually. Wrestle's probably better, even though it's one less tackle zone for me. At least it gets him down. I don't know who's getting the ball. And quite frankly, I don't care who's getting the ball. <laughs> All I know is... <laughs> this dive was getting blitzed. I think maybe he picks it up. As dumb as it is. Nah, 
he's got to pick it up, hasn't he? Because he's faster. <gasps> Can't just make a two dice block. Can't foul him, I've got no one to foul with. GFI to hit him. He can go that and make the cage. He can go that and make the cage. So all he has to do is fucking pick it up. Or do I do the GFI to hit first? I just want to do the fucking GFI to hit first. I guess he stands up now because he makes the cage. So he can just stand up now to make it safer. I can go there. So maybe it's not an absolute loss if this is a failed pickup. Maybe him going there first is actually better as well. Cost. <sighs> Don't know if I was better off taking the push of the pork down there. Lot of fouling was good. And then having an extra attack of one standing around the wall. Got a canoeing threat. So. Oh, good. First reroll is needed. Oh no, he got an extra one. He did greed. He did greed a block. Oh, good for you, mate. Out oh, in no tackle zones? No, in one. Well, it doesn't matter because it would have left my guy standing, but it would have also left his guy standing, and he would have hit again. Oh, he would have hit again, wouldn't he, for fuck's sake? He would have hit again in another red die, so I absolutely should have taken the push. God, I'm a fucking idiot. So, yeah, I should have taken the push. I should have absolutely hit the, taken the fucking push. Giving him another chance to roll a skull. Dicker. Pure dicker. I didn't even realise she had wrestle, so it was my, it was my bad. I was getting another scatter, fuck's sake. I'm sure he won't get an unlucky one. Should have taken it. Wow, I can't. 
Literally can't believe you failed. I can't believe you failed the dice roll. Right, he can catch it and run away. But he can be the canoring threat. In case that doesn't happen. Seems like a good idea. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, pass. I mean, passing in the rain. <laughs> Seems like... About the dumbest, he can just go, can he? Actually, he can go six. So, one, two, three, four, five, GFI, GFI, handoff. And then he goes six over here. And both reach. Well, they're okay for what if it fails. These two will screen if it works. He's okay for the. Mm, so if the pickup fails. It'd be good to have him there. It would also be good to have him there. If it didn't. What happens if he goes to here? Let's get two people screening, right? So that means. He comes back to here in case the handoff fails. And he goes here in case the pickup fails. There you go, of course. I know I tell you. <laughs> Once upon a time, everybody killed everybody. And now, it's just a load of shit. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, a claw, a claw for the pickup fail, and then that warrior for the handoff fail. Ah, oh, that's why I should have taken a push look. Yeah, I really should. I was really bad taking the ball down here. It's a referee. Really fucking stupid. Think which health quick <laughs> carrier, yeah. Got a big payoff. I mean, it's not that bad odds, though. To be fair, like the, the uphill block isn't that bad odds if we can get the strip. That's the sad thing. It's not even, it wasn't even a bad fucking play. All that low percentage. And this touchdown isn't too unlikely either, is it? No, I think. At least it doesn't have a reroll.
Right, so 2 plus dodge to pick it up, 2 plus to pick it up, and then what? 2 plus to hand it off. <laughs> yeah, my chores were mostly killed by rocks. Yeah, that was crazy. And the craziest thing is, the craziest thing is, Jellio, the Blood Bowl 1 rocks were worse before I started streaming. I actually wrote it down. I, I, uh, I had this fucking, I wrote down the match reports and that, and it was, it was, it was completely outrageous. You wouldn't, you wouldn't believe it. Um, right, this looks like there's a shot. To, uh, ah, no, I'd have to chain him up the ball, wouldn't I? Because I can't get somebody in there. I'd have to chain him up the ball. Let's see what happens. He doesn't have dodge, though. Two assists there, so... Cancel the assist. Ooh, we've got a guard in. That's even better. Good bolt, but it's not worth it with a 4 4 to need it. It's a 4 plus, 4 plus to score, isn't it? So there's no point using a wizard for a 4 plus, 4 plus. There's no way I can chain them away. I just have to go for the bounce. I hope it's not so bad. Don't see how there's an easy chain. Can't get anyone in here. Can't hit from there. Well, I can take it a lot better on turn, like, with with him not having another turn. If he'd have another turn, I'd have been super pissed. I mean, I was unlikely to get the pickup score, wasn't I? So... I'd already resigned myself to failure. I can't foul, because... <laughs> taking a cast. <laughs> At least he's got three kills, so the second half is a chance. So it's just gonna be a draw at best, isn't it? And this killer bar. No, he didn't. Didn't get the killer back. Oh, right, that's good, isn't it? So at least I shouldn't get too outbashed in the second half. And uh, I had four euros, I thought you only had three. Oh, leader. Leader, right, okay. Um, so yeah, you know, I should be able to get a draw, hopefully. Like, you know, the, the fact that he just wasn't going to score on me made it, yeah. How he was going to fail, not if, yeah. Like, if it was... If he had, if he had caught it and then gone and had another turn, I obviously would have been really fucking pissed. But as it was, it's just failed a, failed a long shot. Not going to feel too bad about that. 
<laughs> Obviously, it, it failed at the first hurdle, typically. Could really do with a fucking show, man. I'll tell you. But yeah, it was my fault. I should have taken the push. Simple as. No excuse for taking the ball down against the wrestler. Should have, should have realised. Should have wrestled. Yeah, he did, yeah. Yeah, I, I, it looked like there was a chain on it. First I thought, oh, good easy chain. Then I realised it wasn't occupied. It wasn't really fucking... It wasn't really fucking possible to do. No, I don't think there was. I don't think there's a chain on it. Well, not, not, not involving a six plus dodge, anyway. <laughs> Friends wouldn't help us, would it? Sort of thing. Twelve caught in. I mean, to be fair, it was, it was uh, that after that fucking pitch invasion, to nearly have a chance of scoring at the end was all right, wasn't it? Well, this is why this team's getting so many fucking draws. Two, three, four, five, six. So let's put in there. Let's put him there. And him there. Ugh, fucking misposition. I don't know what happened to my dice. I didn't always used to roll like this every fucking game. Didn't used to be like this. I don't know what happened. But <laughs> now I just can't find my way out of a wet paper bag. I was the most, most bashiest coach on Fumble all time. When I was winning games as well, Studman was just fouling 16 turns and claw pumping and everything. And I was just winning games and murdering the fuck out of everybody. I just don't get how this has happened. I just don't fucking get how it's happened. So try it in the TV Plus. <laughs> Yeah. If TV Plus was in effect, he would have uh, he would have something like uh, 
350 TV inducements. I did it with Chaos actually. That when I was the Bashir's coach on Fumble, it was with Chaos with four uh, four Clopon Warriors. Yeah, do you know what, Jellyo? Do you know what? There was some fucking there was some asshole on Fumble. Jimmy, you were way bashier when you had toes, no ass cancer, and weren't on hormones for your transition. Let's face it, you are not the man you used to be. Thanks. <laughs> um, yeah, there was someone in, in fucking oh, the White Isle League, some fucking arsehole that I played. He had a 2000 TV Dark Elf team, and he had loads of bludge everywhere. I've got a fucking rookie... Rookie fucking chaos team, and then after he wins, he goes, "I knew it'd be easy against you." And I was like, oh, "Fuck you," you know. Oh man, that really, that really wound me up the most. Fucking prick. That's like a fucking seven hundred TV advantage with dark elves. It wouldn't have mattered if I'd fucking take and tackle first instead of like I've got three skills on my team. Should have taken a tackle guy, shouldn't I? And just tackled it. Yeah, Shawnee, it's it's just it's not it's not that I'm gonna change who I am or anything. I'm just gonna not be a dickhead in future about, you know stuff like you know, things. Yeah, again sidestep is horrible. You know the thing. The thing with I, I don't know. It was fun. The thing we did with with you know the the Dung Zone match, but it was it was a bit mean and pointless, wasn't it? Got to pick it up next time, otherwise it's a loss. Oh, I'm blitzing even though I don't have fucking tackle. The GFI count. Right. Can do with three dice before the pickup. Good. No fucking cage diving for you, you prick. No, apart from this agility five, dude. Why did I do that? I can't even reach there. For some reason I thought I was going to fucking magical fucking land over here to get in a cage. Fuck that one. Should have based them up some. <laughs> yeah, Shawnee. Full sent up balls in <laughs> Oh,
Yes, yeah, so that guy went to a good spot, but this guy went in just a nothing place, didn't he? The idea of that was should maybe base him or something. Make it harder for them to come through. It's going to be hard from the sack now, isn't it? So it should be down to one re-roll. <laughs> Both re-rolls used to fucking get the ball. Hopefully it should be it should be all right now, shouldn't it? Should be able to get the one-one with a wizard in hand still. Not really a good chance to use it, was there? So he shouldn't even be able to screen or anything now. Fuck's sake. <laughs> He's got a second strip. I forgot about that. Yeah, so that guy really should have been in there, shouldn't he? I, mean, I can bowl this guy this turn anyway. Reroll the five plus pickup. Gets it. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, but that was again that was my fault because I just got fucking thought I was gonna be able to get to here and I just had no no way to get there. So if that guy had stood in the right place that move would have been harder, wouldn't it? This isn't even Melpool's even looking at it. Hey! You finally failed the thing. Oh, good! Fuck you! Good. to go there. Mm, he's from four. Nice. He, he still can't get to this fucking cage up here. If he goes there, he's at the top of the cage. And that means he can get a punch in. Oh, 
he's there. Does he get to blitz him? I'd love to blitz with a claw bomb, but ultimately you don't want to blitz with a claw bomb if it loses you the game, do you? So. You can make a blitz. Can't use my third reroll on the pickle and <laughs> still probably fail and just lose. <laughs> Picked it up. One, two, three, four, G. It's <laughs> <laughs> three, he's all GFI. <laughs> that didn't I didn't have anyone I didn't have anyone left, did I? That was the problem. <laughs> You know, having to protect the bomb instead of... Oh, and he died. Yeah. Great. <laughs> yeah, minus actually, to be fair. It's just annoying sometimes. It's not dead, but it's, it's suboptimal, isn't it? That's all. At the end of the day, claw mighty bow guy is worth his TV. Yeah, I'll keep him. There. Good. <laughs> oh man, that just comes from Table Leg. Table Leg, who streams now, actually. Every time in Magic, <laughs> something horrific happened. He'd just be like, good. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's, he just empties his hand onto the board. No cards in hand, fully committed to all these monsters on the board. Like, And then his opponent's like, oh, you know, he, no, let's say, for example, he's playing Affinity. Dumps his entire hand on the board. They're like, go Shatterstorm. Destroy all his permanents. And he's like, good. <laughs> that, that sort of thing. Everything is just like, good, was his only reaction. I think. <laughs> and he could kind of... Yeah. CDBs, yeah, CDBs getting minus edge is, is alright, isn't it? Because they're already agility 2, but one of the strengths of, of Chaos is being able to dodge around, isn't it? And it is a bit annoying, but obviously, yeah, Claw Mighty Blow is better than a rookie, so he's going to have to be kept. It is a bit of a silly game, isn't it? At least these two, he didn't. He didn't risk the four plus two plus three. And get a, get the fuck away from him now. Next time. He's running out of players, isn't he? Thanks to these kills. Oh god, that wasn't the plan. Holy shit. Let's do the rust cage. <laughs> okay now. As much as I can anyway. Screen off the stripper as well.
Yeah, like Black Orcs I wouldn't mind, but uh, but an Orc Blitzer I wouldn't mind. Yeah, it's true, Jelly. Yeah. <laughs> you can't need the nine man cage next turn. <laughs> Fucking hell. Really sad to not win this game, but um, what fucking a draw's gonna be. Look lucky in the end, isn't it? The way things have gone. Could have easily been two 0 down and out of it. Fucking bad adverts on. What a dickhead. Whoa, hello, Goliath Games. <laughs> Yeah, Jellio, it felt like it as well. But... <clears throat> Fucking rough in it. It's rough to just keep drawing with this team. It, it doesn't, none of the draws feel that bad. So it feels like I've been shot on by the dice every like every game with this team. <laughs> it's it's nuts. Try power him, haven't I? Don't want to leave a gap, so I don't get to support him, sadly. No strip ball for you. <laughs> How would you like them biscuits? Take a lot of resources and it wouldn't achieve much, would it? Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> I wouldn't have taken that much resources with it, it chain in that shape. Yeah, there's your answer. There's your answer. Go, young. <laughs> Mad laughing, yeah, study. Three turns, one reroll to try and get down against these guys. I shouldn't have done that now. Cage. It was just for the, it was just for the lols to be honest. Pulling the canal card there a bit, but that really was just for the fucking lols. It'd be a good cage if I was further forward or had more turns left. Move up. <laughs> no, I don't know. I think I should. I think I should fucking put some things in. Because it's going to be too easy for him to warm me off next turn, isn't it? If I don't put some contact in here. Yeah, I do think basing everything is the smart play. But I've only got four players that can base. And then you'll just be able to dodge in for a fucking uphill strip. If that was a good idea or not. Guess we'll find find out soon. Oh fi. Yeah, I think it was the right play, because you've got to make him roll dice to get back. Need need the flexibility to go either side. Yeah, it has, hasn't it? It has been a, been a fucking while. <laughs> oh, God. Peace, peace, peace. This will be. I'm on route. An extra one turn forward might make all the difference, eh? Never know. Oh, 
that lets us go away from the stripper though. Which is good. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, so that's no GFIs required. Fucking glorious. This is a horrible place for him to stand though, isn't it? Stopping us getting in there as well. Just for once, yeah. Yeah, and gave you just the last gun. Yeah, that's true, isn't it, Joe? Yeah, that's true. That's true. British Christmas weather, yeah, absolutely fine. <laughs> Yeah, it depends. I mean, the the L screen by itself doesn't work, but if you can if you can somehow get somebody down the sideline or whatever, then obviously the the double the double banks do work if you've got to go through them. And I mean, twice today I've had to fucking dodge through like an L screen. I don't know if well on the three plus anyway because of it. So. I guess this L screen probably will work then. You got your wish. <laughs> So it's going to be a GFI, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Alright, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I, I just don't know where to hit him from. I make the push. If you push to there and follow, then it's okay. So therefore the assists. Thank you. 
you know what? I fucked up. That was a no Shawnee no, wasn't it? I should have had two people in the end zone in case the GFI failed. Misplay, not punished. Thanks, God. doesn't have frenzy now. Yeah, it was a blitzer. It was a blitzer that had block. It was this. It was this blitzer here with the uh, the strip ball and that. Thanks, Jelly. -O. It was. The, this whole game was pretty difficult in the fucking rain, and uh, yeah, they've made them more. Made them a lot more lower now, haven't they, than they were, than they used to be. That was the sort of changes they made. The speed skate that stands for the runners, and the uh, and the really hunched over blitzers were in Legendary Edition for some reason. And, uh, hello, VIP Dr. Mama Bosco. <laughs> um... Wow. Brutal. Brutal jelly deals. Um, that's a good question, Vulpies and Kulta. Um, VIP, super VIP Vulpies and Kulta. Um, I think it probably is, yeah, to be honest. <laughs> Crazy, really. Um, yeah, I guess it is, to be honest, because I'm just struggling to fit in another game. And I've got lots of stuff to do while I'm back in England. Mostly learning German, so I want to find out exactly how to learn German for free on the internet, or at least for cheap. And then I might stream my efforts to learn German, which might be funny, might not it? Um, I might get tips off people. Who knows? Um, but yeah. <laughs> Solo off camera.
That's true, BB Snow, but there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of um, Senai's friends that don't speak and a family that don't speak English. So <laughs> it's more it's more Senai's friends and family. Than I mean, I've got by more or less because people can speak. Everyone can speak some English, but it would obviously be better if I could speak German. And if I want to move to Germany and become a German, then you've got to be able to speak German, haven't you? So, uh, yeah, anyway, another fucking draw. <laughs> For sake. Only just outbroken AV there. Made a lot of dodges, didn't he? <laughs> 51 dodges is quite a lot. And he did pass them really well, and it's just the crucial ones at the end there that let the screen not do anything. Um. I hate to break this to you, Jimmy. Senai's friends speak English but just don't want to speak with you. <laughs> Feels bad, man. <laughs> no, honestly, they've been uh, they've all been absolutely lovely. So <laughs> Nobody's required anything. Oh in Italy. <laughs> no. Yeah, Sanai 89 is German, so yeah, she absolutely speaks German. She also speaks English, like, perfectly. She speaks English better than most English people that I know. Um, which has obviously made it easier for me to not bother learning speaking German. So yeah, I don't sack him. 13 players, 2 miss next games, so I might buy a 14th guy. Rather than sack him and only have 11 for a game could buy one and have the movement 5 guy as a reserve and then sack the movement 5 guy after that game or something I'll think about it so this is actually a good time to end the stream because I'm like, I don't know what to do with that it's fucking all these draws man <sighs> dragging us down um, right thanks for watching if you enjoyed it don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.